Hey, welcome back. So today, right now, I'm gonna do somebody a favor. There it is. They have a whiteboard they need installed. It's not a large board. Uh, it looks like it's two foot by three foot. It's a glass whiteboard. And there isn't really any place to hang it on the wall in here. And so I asked how about putting it on that window thing back there. And she's like, yeah, that would work. How would you do that? I'm gonna put it up exactly the same way I would put a mirror up using silicone. Yeah, watch me go. Buckle up for safety as I give you a day in the life of online. No, not online. I'm actually there. Facilities maintenance. There really isn't any secret to uh, doing something like this, other than if you're going to do something like this, even the small jobs, it pays to take the time to um, center things, make them straight, make them even, um, you know, all of that stuff. It just shows a little bit more care than, um, yeah, eyeballing it. So for instance, instead of eyeballing it and just sticking this thing up here, well, what I've done is I've brought with me these little blocks. And they're simply gonna sit here, but they're gonna be my pieces that hold the whiteboard up uh, that'll keep them from sagging and uh, I'll measure side to side to make sure it's centered and then I'll take masking tape and lay it down over the whole board to uh, give it a chance to set. Now they actually make uh, silicones that are designed specifically for attaching mirrors to walls. Of course nobody seems to have it in stock however um, you can get away with using this. This is also a pure silicone. It is clear. And if you look right there, it says strong adhesion. Uh, you want something that is going to have strong adhesion. Uh, it also says in the fine print that it adheres to glass. It will work just fine for what, uh, for the application I have for it. You need to have the right product. Don't use something like a construction adhesive to put a mirror on a wall. Another reason I wanted clear is because on the back side of this window, I don't want you to see big glue lines. Okay, let me explain my little markings I've got going on here. This uh, references center of the whiteboard. And on the glass here, what I've done is measured my total width and found center here. These are the blocks that are gonna hold it in place. See, doing it that way, I'm gonna have the back of this whiteboard covered in silicone and I can place it up on the glass window there without having to, um, there's no guesswork. I don't have to fiddle around with it. It's just a one and done. I don't have to put it on, take it off. Ah, I missed, find center, measure, where am I? Any of that. I want this to be a clean installation the first time and so I've gone and made all the measurements and markings that I need to make ahead of time. Now, let me show you how to lay the silicone down on the back of the whiteboard, or mirror, as it may be. And there you have it. Now, you don't want it to squish out around the edges, and so you do want to stay back a little bit. But because you don't want this to slide down, there's a reason for the pattern on here, and that's it. I've, that's why I've got straight lines running back and forth, and I've been very liberal with the silicone. Um, in fact, as I'm going through it, my hope is that uh, I have enough in the tube to make it all the way because don't be afraid to use lots. Use all of it if you need to. Um, but yeah, so now what I'm gonna do is place it up on the wall over there. Be very careful not to drop it.
This could very well stay just as is without me doing anything else. I am not going to take that chance. I'm going to tape it down. Okay, um, my blocks are ensuring that it is level to the frame. My center mark is dead on. And that tape, I'll leave that there until tomorrow to hold it in place. Um, let's go see what it looks like from the backside. <laughs> okay, so it does show up. I would have had to have taken a trowel and troweled out a full smooth layer over the whole thing for it to not show up, I guess. Um, hey, you can always hang a poster on this side or put a matching whiteboard on this side. Oh well. It's all about what it looks like in here, right? And in here, it'll look really good. So, um, yes. We can worry about the backside at some other point in time, if it matters. But for now, that is how you put up a mirror or a whiteboard using silicone. Thanks for watching.